Hi, in this video I'm going to demonstrate how to replace the fuse on this Fluke 106 multimeter. And I take a flat screwdriver and on the back you can see there is two little signs. The one says unlock, it's like a padlock which is open and then one over here which says locked. So there's the arrow. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to rotate this. It doesn't matter whether it's anti-clockwise or clockwise until the unlock symbol is in alignment with the arrow. Now I can just peel this open. There the cap opens. Now using a star screwdriver I just need to remove one, two, three screws. I'm going to remove the batteries just so that it's easier to work with. Now what I do is I take a screwdriver and I just press it in here to separate the side. There you can see it has lifted a bit and I'm just going to press here and it was also lifted a bit and I'm just going to depress here and there we can see the sides are separating. Right, so the two sides have separated. There is the fuse. Right, so I'm just going to remove the fuse. Right, the size of the fuse for this multimeter is an 11 amp, 1000 volt with an interrupting capacity of 20,000 amps. This is the fuse that was inside the unit. It is a Busman fuse. I could not get this fuse, but I have a similar one. This is also a 1000 watt, 11 amp fuse, also with 20 kilo amp interrupting capacity for both DC and AC. I'm now going to insert the fuse. Right, I line the two sides together using a balance pressure. I squeeze these two sides. I now return the three screws. Right, to return the back cover, there are two posts over here which align to the back there and I rotate it inwards and then I just lock it in place. My meter will now be able to measure amps again. Thanks for watching and cheers.